YouTube. Y'all know who it is and what time it is. You know who I got with me and you see what he doing. I'm not going to show you the fish though because listen, this is what I want y'all to see. Hey man, have you ever heard that the marabou jig catches the mess out of sand bass? Let's see if this little tiny jig can catch sand bass. Stay tuned, let's go. That already on the board, man. Ooh -wee. Hey, man. That's a nice one, Dad. Yeah, yeah. What was that fight like? It's a good pool. They pull real hard. They're nice fish to catch. If you want pulling power, this is one to catch. That boy, that's a Dodge Cummins <clears throat> right there. Oh, yeah. That's well, a Dodge Cummins right with there. This one. Let's go in there and get some more. Okay, here we go. Stopped by Walmart, picked up some of these 1 16th ounce Marabou jig heads. Marabou jigs, excuse me. Marabou jigs, and what I'm gonna do is tie a double jig rig, cause we might be able to catch some doubles. Real quick, man, if y'all don't already know, make your tag end very long. I'ma take it and I'ma tie a loop knot up top. I'ma go through two or three times, and hope that my knot don't slip up top, all right? Boom. So what I have already is one there and then a bunch of tag. I'm going to go in my package. I'm going to grab one more of these marabous. And I'm going to do the same thing over again, guys. We don't have to overcomplicate this process. And I want to make sure that I leave enough space between them. I want about a foot. 12 to 18 inches is good. Make another loop knot, cut my tag, and there's my double jig, marabou jigs, all right? Guys, we located some sand bass, and I want to see if these little white jigs, this is what they look like wet. I want to see if these little jigs are going to do the trick, man. We're going to be using the uh, six-foot one-piece ACC crappie stick, and I'm going to tell you what, man, this little rod is powerful, but it lets you enjoy the fight. Let's see if we can get into these sand bass. All right, guys, I know it's flickering. Y'all forgive me for that. But what I want to do is show y'all that we are in the sand bass. Y'all see that over there? Y'all see it over there? Will they hit this marabou jig is the question. Let's see, is there any this way? Not any that way. But when I turn this thing to the right, guys, they light up. Okay? We're going to cast over there, see if we can get them to bite. I was already hooked up. I was already hooked up, y'all. He come off. Dad hooked up. Let me get out of his way. You hooked up? You come off. Man, what's going on with this coming off stuff? Oh, there he is. Light him up, Ken. I'll tell you what's happening. These fish are following these jigs out a little ways before they decide to commit. But that's another bottom jig that time. I mean, this creek is loaded chalk full, y'all. Another sandbag. Ooh, sweetest hook set in the south. What you doing, man? You got something on here. Huh? Might be a sandy bass. Might be a band sash you got on there. Let's see what we got. Oh man, look like you got. I'm gonna get in there while, while you while you did delivering that that baby. Yeah, yeah man. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a eater. Yeah, that's a eater. Eater, pocket needle. Pocket needle. Yeah, that's a good one here. Yeah. Might get the shoulders off of him and take a look at him. You gonna take a look at him? I'm gonna keep two. Okay, well that's number two there, ain't it? Yeah, that's it. No more after this. I'm gonna keep two. I ain't ate now with him in a long time. Years. Yeah, you might have yourself some. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I might blacken him. See how it tastes. Put some sea salt on him. Fish on.
there's another one. Baby. What you doing, Dad? Uh, to With the double. Yes, sir. That's a keeper. No, he is a tennis shooter. He would have been a keeper if we were keeping him. Yeah, man. Look at him. Come on out of there, Dad. You got a feisty, don't you? Yeah, you We'll go this way. I don't know what the world went on in. No. Hang on, I'm waiting over you. Oh. Mm. He was just before on the catch, man. I'm trying to tell you something. Oh. Man. Times he went to the table too. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be throwing them back because I used to eat them. I just took a like in the crop it better. He tastes better. Yeah, but I have eaten. I'm gonna be on the line. He was so light. Mm, I seen him. Sandbag pulled just as hard as a catfish. That's crazy, ain't it? Yeah. A tennis sandbag will give you a good fight. Oh, he'll, he'll fight it. He'll fight you now. Yeah, a good fight. But I like them for Uh-oh. They like them black crabs. Uh-oh. Do I got a fish on? I don't know what you got. I, <laughs> yeah, I think I, you yeah, do. I do. I casted it out so I could... Oh, look down the bottom, Daddy. Oh, yeah. Oh, bunch of them. Bunch of them. I think they're gone. The mud ran. <laughs> look. To the right. So you write more. <laughs> Got him? Yeah. Oh man, good one. No, that's a crappie. <laughs> <laughs> that's a crappie down there. Yeah, wait a Look at that pound of weight. Hold on. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> All your horses now. Yeah, okay. I mean, a nice one. Let me see that yeah, crappie, man. Yeah, let me see it. Let me go take a look. Yeah. All right, guys. We're doing it all like today, I guess. Yeah. Man, they're acting like crappie, daddy. No, nah, that ain't. But I say now, you better not be no crappie. Well, I know something. Yeah, I had to take a second look at that. That's a crappie. No, it ain't. Yeah. All right. I can see you. It's a good sand daddy, though. I mean, just as many as you want to see. All right, guys, I'm going to do something just a little bit different. I'm still going to go with the double jig rig. Right now, I'm tying in two of the uh, Euro Tackle tungsten jig heads, 1 16th ounce. I just was getting wore out with how slow those 1 16th, actually, 1 seconds were falling. I mean, it was just... It was nasty. It'll be tomorrow before I can get it to drop three times. So, so what we're gonna do, we're going with the Euro tackles. Same thing, double jig rig, white jig heads. I'm gonna go into my little, go into my little bag of tricks. See if I can't find two that I like. I 
saw one that I liked already. Yep, that's what I wanted right there. Euro tube, guys. That's what we're gonna try. Put two of them bad boys on. See if we can't catch a few more fish. So I guess what that would do, that let me know. Is it a color thing or was it the marabou? Because you know the tails on the marabou, they have a different activity, different kind of movement. Y'all gonna learn today. As we got the Euro tubes ready to go, EuroTackle.net. Use promo code Hook City if you're trying to get 10% off your your purchase, man. Okay, that one stung like a bee. Oh man, come on. He stung like a bee on that Euro tackle. Oh now. God dang man. That's two god dang tungstens. Both of them gone that fast. Shoot. There's some crappie down in there. You know what they are yet? They ain't biting this jig. Sand bass. You know what they is? Gotta be all that. Gotta be. Got him? Crappie. Mm -hmm. That's a bigger sized one there now. Mm -hmm. That's a bigger sized one there. Yeah, it is. It's a crappie. Yeah, that's a bigger specimen. <laughs> hey, and just like that, man, I hope y'all enjoyed that video, man. This is what I need y'all to know. There is no one trick pony. There is no one jig that's good for sand bass, man. As y'all saw, dad put a whooping on me. He never touched a marabou jig. Hope y'all enjoyed that video. And if you want to see more like it, man, make sure you go to Hook City TV, the homepage, man, and check out all that we have to offer. We got more videos coming real soon. The spawns around the corner. Fish are staging. It's still the winter time, but fish are staging. Y'all stay tuned for what's to come, man. It's your boy Fishing King, Hook City TV. I'm out, chip.